and, and I thought, you know, they had something to do with it. I told the players, you got to be accountable. Uh, it starts with me. I did not have a great game plan tonight. Uh, did not have, wasn't comfortable with our defensive game plan. Um, offensively, they changed defenses enough to kind of disrupt us and didn't feel like we, we didn't execute. Uh, that's my responsibility. Um, Coach Grant got his players to play really well in this game, especially in the second half, and I didn't get my players to play really well. Antoine Mason had a strong game. KT did what he did. But beyond that, we really struggled. Um, we rely heavily on Simeon Bowers. And uh, when Sim doesn't play as well as he's capable of, it's, it's hard for us to win. And unfortunately, uh, some of his mistakes were you know, obviously really magnified. But uh, can't let a team shoot 60%. Uh, Alabama's, you know, they're, they're very athletic, very strong, very quick, very powerful, big, and, you know, they dominated the boards. We looked, we looked slow and, uh, and poorly prepared. That's my responsibility, so. Coach, in that second uh, half, do you feel like it was something that Alabama's offense made an adjustment, or was it something that maybe you felt your team wasn't executing defensively? I mean, I think that, um, they're hard to guard. Take take the point guard matchup. Obasahan uh, just just had his way. Anytime he wanted to get to the rim, he got to the rim, and he drove right around our point guards. And um, um, we don't have you know Trayvon has got a chance to be a good player someday, but he's not ready yet. So I have no shot blockers, no size, no rim protectors. We don't do a great job of rotating the take charges. So they got to the rim, they got deep anytime they wanted to, and that's been one of our our challenges all season long. They did a good job of exploiting it. Coach, you have probably been a big problem tonight. It's been a while. I'll talk about that. What's that? Rebounding. Well, again, um, you know, Taylor and Kessens and Hale, those three guys are you know, bigger than anybody we have. And then Randolph and Cooper are really big, strong guys at their positions. Obasa and big physical player. They just, you know, so they, but, and I talked to some of the guys before the game, some of the media guys saying, Alabama is bigger than us. We played against teams that were bigger than us. But they, they did a good job of taking advantage of, of their size and their athleticism. And, um, there's a lot of great teams in this league. And, um, you know, we, we didn't, we're not scaring anybody. And, um, we, when we didn't dictate tempo, we weren't sharp offensively. Um, just, I mean, they, they were obviously, you know, confident. I was concerned because we played so well in Alabama. I mean, we, we did everything that we needed to do to win the game that we don't finish the game off by not rebounding the ball and they make a couple plays and we, and we don't take advantage of that. Um, I knew Alabama would play better than they did. They played much better than they did at Alabama, at Alabama and as a result, they got the win.